Okay guys, I'm trying to get my day started and this one's trying to convince me that I need to just climb back in bed and let him sleep on top of me. Look at him. Looking so sleepy. Say hi everybody. This is Tippy. See his tippy tail? Tippy was late to breakfast this morning, weren't you? Hmm. All right. On to whatever we're going to get up to. Decided I'd go to Hobby Lobby. Got my coupon. And did the dishes. And a pan was about to fall, so I reached out to grab it. And yeah, I got the letter C cut into my knuckle. Feels great, too. Anyway, I'm off to Hobby Lobby and just to get out of the house for a few minutes. Yep, having lunch. I already ate my panini and soup, so I've got unsweetened black tea, and I've got my apple left, and I bought a pastry. One of those ooey gooey pecan things for later. Um, I did pick up some things at Hobby Lobby, but they're in the back seat, and I can't reach them right now. So we'll share those when we get back to the house. But I'm just going to run over to Goodwill real quick. I'm just feeling the need to be out of the house today. So not spending a lot of money, just goofing off. See you later. Bye. Okay, we're back at the house and I'm showing the shirt that I got Scott because at the Goodwill just now I found a Michael Kors tie to go with Scott's shirt and I just thought I would show isn't that gonna go good look at that and he's got the black slacks to go with it and I helped Scott out and I found um, what do they call these a camisole so I can wear here I'll just turn the whole rack how about that pick it up and turn it around here and this has got a little place here to hang a camisole and it's from Kato's and I can wear that underneath there and be more modest Ta-da! I think he'll be tickled. I forgot to tell him about that when I was... You can't see straight through it anymore. So, anyway. And that was a dollar. I got the tie for a dollar and the camisole for a dollar. I want to wash the camisole before I wear it. Alright, and now I'm going to stop you and I'll be right back. Okay, also at the Goodwill... I got Success with House Plants by Reader's Digest. And um, it's got lots of good info in it. And I to my total, when I rounded up, was $4. That's all I spent at Goodwill. So the book was, I guess, two, right? Maybe, or less, I don't know. And then, of course, you saw my goodies from Panera. I've got my apple and my, my sticky bun. I can make y'all drool. And I had that in the truck, so that's what I stuck my food in. Crazy cat lady. Um, show you my my sticky ooey gut. Don't tell. But look, doesn't it look yummy? Anyway, I miss baked goods. I get myself something occasionally, not every time. All right, and then I went into Hobby Lobby. Um, I got a T-square and some more Kmar varnish because um, my can's almost empty. And those are the only two things I went in Hobby Lobby for. I used a coupon on this and this was only, the T-square was only $3.99. But then I went to the clearance section and y'all know the clearance section is like the worst place to visit if you're trying not to spend money. I got this We Are Memory Keepers DIY Party and it's a goodie bag guide and you can make all these different kind of goodie bags and I guess it's just a tear guide because that's what it looks like you lay it down and you tear one side of the paper 
and then you flip it over and tear the opposite direction up t at the top, fold it together, and it's done. So we'll have to do a review on that one together. We'll pull it out. And then these Dina Wakely mixed media um, faces were on clearance. They were normally $9.99, and I paid $3.59. And then you've got all these wonderful words. And I thought these are the perfect size for artist trading cards. And those could be a lot of fun to use. I got this for my son. Don't just stand there. Pamper me. And it's the cat from that movie, Secret Life of Pets, that I watched the other day on um, Netflix. And I don't know if I told you all about that or not. I think I, it was on a part of a video that I did that didn't turn out so y'all didn't hear that before but if you haven't watched the secret life of pets and you don't mind watching a kids movie it is so stinking cute anyway and then they I got paint they had this Grumbacher's uh, acrylics that's normally eight bucks I got it for 287 and I got a yellow ochre and then they had a bunch of craft paints that they were closing out on let's see that's folk art, folk art. And there's no real re rhyme or reason to the pricing. Because some of these, this one was $1.36. That was $0.82. Cents, $0.82. Cents. So, oh, I know why. This is an enamel, the purple. So I got light lavender in the enamel. And then in the just the acrylics, I got Aberjean. I guess that's how you say it. Aberjean. Giant, I don't know. Lilac Ice <laughs> and Nepal Crimson, I bet that is under there. So that's the colors. And then in Americana, I got Terra Coral and Margarita. Thought those were pretty cool looking colors. And then in the Ceramicote, I just got purple. I'm trying to get my rack full of craft paint, and since this was on sale, some of these, like this Americana was only seven, these two were, the Americanas were 71 cents, but they were, they were mostly colors that I didn't really care for, so I didn't get a lot, sorry, I didn't mean to bump it, but anyway, I'm going to close the windows up where I, I try to open the windows in the mornings and air the place out. And uh, it's reached that stage of the day where I need to uh, close the windows and turn the air back on. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.